All right, what is going on, everybody? It's your boy Connor, your primitive AK here, back with another video for you guys today. Today we are here with the brand new Tech Nine SMG. All attachments and customization options available for this weapon. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. And its Warzone counterparts are almost identical, just slightly different uh, performance attributes like range and also extra damage. So let's take a look at the attachments that are, this thing is included with in the Cold War title. So your optics are pretty much all standard to the same. Nothing changes here. These are not new sights that previous other pretty much every single weapon in cold war uh, and also warzone has so these are no different attachments that you guys have ever seen on any other weapons in cold war for your uh muzzles this is where things get a little bit different you're going to get the muzzle break nine your flash guard nine burst fire repeater which is going to turn it into a three round burst weapon infantry compensator your silcom eliminator and also the full auto repeater which is going to turn it into a full auto weapon so pretty much the other attachments that i mentioned are not new to the game but the the uh, full auto repeater is going to give it more fire rate as well as turn it into a full auto weapon and your burst fire repeater is also going to boost up that fire rate while also slightly nerf nerf your range a bit but turning it into a burst fire weapon your barrel included is going to be the 5.8 extended cavalry lancer reinforced heavy ranger barrel 7.7 rifled and 8.1 task force to boost up that damage your body is going to include the standard laser and tar target designator and target team uh, spotlight so nothing really changes there but for those that are curious on what your set bonuses are here are the bonuses that are included on these weapons themselves your under barrel is also standard to, as well no new grips here these are all standard to have almost every single weapon you got your foregrip red cell foregrip patrol grip bruiser grip field agent grip and sfld speed grip magazines included are going to be 30 round fast mag 27 round speed mag 39 round Varandil speed loader and also 33 round fast mag handles going to include the speed tape drop shot wrap field tape SASR jungle grip serpent wrap and airborne elastic and lastly your stocks are going to include tactical stock collapse stock duster stock no stock SAS combat stock and the raider stock overall this weapon is a ton of fun, is so much fun to use I had a blast running around with this weapon and uh, it's certainly different it's not overpowered it's not terrible uh, it's just a fun weapon to use and even the semi-automatic setting is does some pretty decent damage and has great range as well i think a lot of people uh, will definitely like using this uh, even in warzone as well and we'll have some gameplay of that as well but let's go ahead and jump right into the gameplay all right ladies and gentlemen we're now here in a pub match with the brand new tech 9 smg let's go ahead and see what this bad boy is made of gonna be my first time using it with no attachments by the way this is the semi-automatic setting on the weapon we'll be checking out some of the other attachments at a later time let's go ahead and see oh this thing's actually this thing's actually not bad it's different it's very different oh I never thought I would ever like a semi-automatic SMG, but here we are, apparently. This thing's actually not bad. Oh, man. That was close. Yeah, it's not broken. It's not overpowered or anything like that, but it's fun to use. And that's something that I never really thought I would enjoy out of a semi-automatic SMG. Oh, boy. I will say it does take it does have a bit of a skill gap if you're using it uh, in this setting. Oh boy. Oh, you're in a corner, really, bro? Just because you're sitting in that corner, have some fun with the streaks, bro. That's for you. Go ahead and call these bad boys in. He's not even playing. Ooh, We're gonna have to mooch you, buddy. I don't even know who was talking. I guess it was this guy. Yeah, this this SMG is really interesting. I, I never really thought. I would ever see myself enjoying a weapon like this before. Semi-automatic SMG. First of its kind, can anybody correct me on that? 
And for any weapon experts, is the Tech 9 actually a semi automatic in real life? Like, does it have a select fire for that? <laughs> and it's got decent range, too. This thing doesn't even have any attachments on it. I'm sure once you throw uh, some of the other bad boy attachments on this thing, you're looking at a very lethal weapon. Alright, let's go this way. Got him? Oh, I gotta put the solos. Oh, teammate, nice one. It's the police. That guy's upstairs. He is camping. Got him. I am so sorry, buddy. Oof, that was a close call. Got two tags there. Mostly just trying to wrap up the game here, because I think most people get the idea. But, uh, overall, both of these DLC weapons, and especially the Tech 9 um, I didn't really think I was ever going to enjoy either of these weapons. Um, because, you know, bullpup weapons can be kind of hard for Call of Duty to kind of get right. Uh, Battlefield gets it right, but so, COD, not all the time. But, uh, regardless, very, very interesting weapon here. I'm actually quite happy they added something like this. Gives uniqueness to the game. Bro, half these people ain't even playing, bro. Oh, don't mind me. Just missing easy shots across the map. And like I said, there is a bit of a skill gap to this weapon, so... You do need to make sure that you're hitting your shots. Otherwise, you are a dead man. For sure. GG's, ladies and gentlemen, 40 in 1 with the brand new Tech 9 SMG. Hopefully you guys do enjoy this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I hope you guys do enjoy this DLC weapon because uh, I personally think it's a lot of fun to use, even in the single fire attachment. We'll be trying out the burst fire attachments as well uh, in a future related video. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. It's your boy Connor, your primitive AK. Signing out. Peace out, fellas.